Good evening. Welcome to Storytime with Jason. I'm Jason, and tonight we read The Fox and the Stork from the revised Aesop's Fables. The fox invited a stork to dinner, at which they at which the only fare provided was a large flat dish of soup. The fox lapped it up with great relish, but the stork, with her long bill, trained oh sorry, tried in vain to partake of the savory broth. Her evident distress caused the sly fox much amusement, but not long after the stork invited him in turn and set before him a pitcher with a long and narrow neck, into which she could fit her bill with ease. Thus, while she enjoyed her dinner, the fox sat by hungrily and helpless, for it was impossible for him to reach the tempting content of the vessel. And Aesop doesn't provide a moral for this, but I will. If I was trying to explain this to my little daughter, it's, man, just like be nice to each other. Don't be... We all have our own strengths. We all have our own limitations. There's all We all have things we're good at. We all have things we're not good at. And in this example, the stork could fit her bill, you know, the, her beak in the very narrow areas. And, and then the fox couldn't. But the fox had a tongue it could lap up from a, from a nice flat area. So we all have things we're good at. We all have things we're bad at. And don't, don't worry if there's things you're not good at. Look at things you are good at, and but also don't rub your. If if you're good at something and somebody else is bad at something, you don't need to make fun of them for it. You don't need to hurt them for it. Just like if somebody else is good at something and you're not, you shouldn't feel bad that you're not good at that thing. We're all good at our own things, and we don't need to be mean to each other to to try and express it or to try and show others how good we are at. Because, and that's another good point. If you're really good at something and you show it off and you make other people feel bad because they're not good at it, well, they might be good at something else that you're not, and then that would hurt too. So there's lots of different things we can take from the fox and the stork, and I hope you enjoyed listening as much as I enjoyed reading. Good night.